got the uh, floorboards for the Draskin Lugger. They're assembled. They're going to go on our 1980 Draskin Lugger Anka High. Putting on a coat of uh, Total Boat Gleam Marine Spar varnished uh, satin. Uh, basically doing it just to kind of seal up the grain of the wood. Don't really want a bright shiny finish on this. In fact, I'll probably do this one coat acting as kind of a wood sealer. Or I could have used the Total Boat wood sealer as well. And then the next time I think it needs a little bit of maintenance, probably just go with a, a, a teak oil. So it, uh, there's the last little piece that hasn't been coated yet. So dip my brush, get a little bit on there. I've already done along the inside of the and kind of moving around you know try to go cross grain first if you like and then just uh, brush it in you can see a little light spot there where it didn't get in there so we'll put a little more on that area Don't want to go on too heavy. You don't want to sit there working a thin coat of varnish all day either. So first coat, I'd do a little bit heavier because there's nothing on this wood. This is just raw wood. I sanded it with 80 grit. And I went with a rougher, actually it was 60 grit, rougher sandpaper. Wanted to leave a little bit of tooth on the wood. We'll be walking on this. Kind of act as maybe a little bit of a non-skid so the This moisture in the varnish is going to raise the wood. The wood fibers will come up. Normally you'd come in on some other pieces and uh, lightly sand the top of that to give it a little tooth for the next coat. But in this case, we're probably just going to leave that as is and uh, go for it. Keeping in mind that this boat is uh, stored in the garage when that's not used, so we're not leaving it out at the dock all day long get uh, beat on by the sun so these are the floorboards for 1980 Draskin lug or Anka high made out of uh, cypress grown here locally hope y'all having a great night